Welcome back to more um, Star Warsy lightsaber battle things. Star lightsaber stinky boy here who doesn't wear enough clothing. Get out of here, boy. Oh, we got the wipe. And we got a loading screen. Yeah. So, what's the best Star Wars and what's the worst Star Wars? Um. Original trilogy is best. Having just rewatched Star Wars Episode One, aside from the last battle with all the the on Mustafar, the, the, the robot the troopers. Oh, that one. Yeah. Aside from just the robot trooper scene, it's good. It yeah. actually holds up. Probably not the best, but enough. But you asked me, yeah, what was the best? What was the worst? Yeah. Um, I'd say three is the best, and two, three, two is the worst, because it's like the bridge between one and three. <laughs> but that's just remembering it from when it first came out. Mm -hmm. I haven't watched it since. I've been avoiding them. Quick piece of trivia. <laughs> Darth Vader doesn't use electricity because it would screw up his mechanics. His, his power suit? Yeah. Yeah, that's why he never uses... Uh... Lightning? Yeah. He's a fire elemental instead? Yeah. I think at some point, eventually, he uses it, but... Was that wall made out of gel? That's like the bay that they go in through. But it rippled. Yeah, it's a weird bay that the ships go into so that they can park. It rippled. It wasn't an energy field. <laughs> Maybe energy fields can ripple too. No. What? <laughs> what? This is so weird without music. What? Do 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 do. What? Da 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 Corn on the com. Corn on the com. So good. Boink. Whoa, I jumped so high. Hello. Get out of here. You guys are on my side, I don't care. Trust them. Oh yeah, I have to do the yeah. yeah, yeah. So it was Z, an X or a Z or eh. I don't know. Eh. You move the prompt too fast. I can't see it. Eh, it's all good. I'll just stab some ugly boys. Kind of make my stuff. laser sword. I'm charging my laser sword. Oh, shoop whoop! I am firing my laser. Here you go. He died. You get it's a little fine. taste of it. Boop. Write you a present. It is paid. Boink. Boink. Zap. Zap. <laughs> Zap. Zap. Why does he make the TIE Fighter sound? Uh, maybe because the TIE Fighters are coming into the parking and stuff. I don't know. It can't be outside the, the ship because you wouldn't be able to hear it through space. That's the mistake they always just don't care about in Star Wars. They're like, yeah, whatever. Who cares? Okay. Yeah. That's why you can always hear the vehicles in space. And it's uncomfortable when you've realized that and then you're like, oh, every other media, they're like, oh, there's no sound in space. We make it a point that you can't scream in space. Um, most things do that with the exception of Firefly was the one that did it the best. Whenever it did like exterior space stuff, there was no like ship audio. It was all like dramatic Doesn't music. Doesn't Star Trek do that? Star Trek makes the sound. Uh, for ships. Oh yeah, gotta do the little wiggly fingers. Give a little poke. Yeah. Alright, wiggly fingers, let's get going. Could he not just fly himself up there? Stand on a platform and just force move the platform he's on? Yeah, that would be much smarter. Or, or is this force like force on yourself. Or is this like laying on a hammock and trying to lift up one end of it? Mm. And you can't lift it because you're on it? I don't know about that. They could probably do it. Droid, get out of here. 
Get to safety. Whoa, that's explosive. Um, I'm dying. Oh no. Wow. Shush. Don't get in my way. I'm a stinky Jedi Slayer. I just realized you have a score. Yeah, it's just to now. upgrade your abilities. Swing my little <laughs> stinky remote. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> get wrecked. You got shoved a little bit. <laughs> that has got to be the most efficient way to kill stuff in this. You just pick stuff up and huck it. Wah! Are you dead? you dead. I want to play Second Sight now. Wah! I... Or uh, PsyOps, the Mind Geek Conspiracy for PS2. I've not tried either. Oh. Yeah. Wow, Jedi Holocrom. Uh, PsyOps was the first game that I played with the Havoc engine built into it. Oh. Yeah, wasn't, it's real good. Wasn't the last game we played Havoc Engine? But PsyOps did yeah. it the best. And you can actually, like, tell, can you tell, t TK surf with it? You can, like, stand a platform and move the platform around on Ooh, purpose. That's yeah. fun. <laughs> the human enemies were called meat puppets, and there's three levels of them, so the hardest ones are called MP3s. <laughs> yeah. Uh, the, the collectibles are little tiny gnome statues that laugh at you when you collect them. That's fun. Yeah. Um, Where am I supposed to go? Am I don't I know, but shouldn't you be falling through that? Nah. It's an air shield, not a weight shield. Nah. Boink. Your chunky butt would fall right through it. <laughs> My chunky buckets? Hell no. Your, your milkshake bringing all of the boys to the yard? We'll Damn right. To that barrier. Um, where am I supposed to go? Maybe the music tells me. Oh well. <laughs> so many objects in this place. Am I supposed to just climb? I imagine you're going to that green oh, circle. Oh, I gotta do some goofiness. Okay. Yeah, 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 we get it. You got strong force powers. Don't gotta rub it in that the rest of us don't. Ooh, rub it in like a steak sauce. A1? Mm. What? Mm. Uh, camera. Wish I could control you. Control that booty, yo. Nah, it speaks for itself. Because uh. it butt talks. Haha. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> I hate me too. I hate, also hate puns. <laughs> Oh no, more enemies! Oh, I gotta... Have you ever eaten out of Montana's? Speaking of steak... Uh, no. No. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Oh no, they're firing a gun. If only I had guns. Boink. Why don't Jedis use guns? Well, I could show you a prime example of that in a video of a weird Star Wars game in VR where you get the option to use a gun do because they, it's overpowered. Do they just block every shot? No. You pretend to swing your lightsaber then you just blast them like 60 times. Oh. Well, I look like to do a white table, Kawo. Hawaii! There he is. Can you say that like you're not on the spectrum? That would be great. Uh... I'd love to, but I can't. So. I went to the London Drugs website to look for types of steak sauce. Yeah. And London Drugs does not sell steak sauce on their website. It has like... Um... Jerky. And knives. And mm. dog food. And, and computers. No, and tongs. But no actual like... HP sauce or VH sauce or... Of course not, that would just be too smart. Just sell everything. No, we're not gonna sell everything, only some things. Does this still work? Oh, they must have sold it. So, um, a long time ago, there used to be a website where you go to it and it has like a picture of a Walmart and in the parking lot is a horse. <laughs> you could go to walmart.horse. Walmart.horse. And there was a lawsuit between Walmart and the owner 
because it used the word Walmart in their URL. So they sued them for it and, and won. But going to that website now does not work. <laughs> they completely removed it. Yeah. How dare you even think about it? Wow, he's so good at the force. Yeah, Walmart.horse is no longer a website. <laughs> Walmart.force. Yeah, it doesn't even 404, it's just website not found. Oh. Okay. Um, so I'm mentioning Walmart because I also look Where for is steak the sauce. Jedi? Yes. So it's like Kraft barbecue sauce. Ah, tell me. Sweet baby rays. I'm dead uh, anyway. A1. Bullseye. Bullseye. Okay. Bullseye. Please. Heinz. Stop. Baby talk. rays. Master. Uh, Go to control Diana steak. That's about it. You know, teriyaki is just a good steak sauce in general. You know. Um, I prefer like Montreal steak spice, where it's the kind of salty, peppery taste. Ah, uh, just a dry rub. Yeah, that's about it. Yeah, I can see it. Like barbecue sauce on ribs is pretty much what I go to if I want like a saucy thing, not steak. Yeah, I suppose. I usually prefer steak with like mushrooms and a bit of teriyaki. Uh, fried onions. Yeah. Or uh, the crispy stuff. Crispy fried onions. Gotta have caramelized onions and mushrooms. Goes so well together. I'd agree, but it depends on what kind of mushrooms. Or how they're cooked, because I've had some pretty bad mushrooms. <laughs> that sounds misleading. <laughs> Whoa! With my steak. Ah. That makes more sense. Oh no. For $21.95 Canadian, you can get a Bristol Novelties costume. Which is a big steak. Uncooked, of course. He's holding a fork and a knife. Yeah. And, <laughs> okay. Yikes. You think the costumes are made out of fabric or plastic? Uh, probably some very thin plastic. More malleable. Easier to print. Aw. I wouldn't be able to fit in it. It's up to a size 44 inch chest. I don't know how big I am. I'm a big boy. I, I got a big chest. I can't find a jacket that fits sometimes. That's got to be a problem. Yep. I used to be a bit chonkier, so all the stuff I own right now is too big for me. The item name is a Bristol Novelties unisex adult steak costume. You don't have to be a man to wear it. You scroll down to the specifications for gender... Female. <laughs> oh. Literally a piece of meat. Uh. Yep. Time to get offended, yo. Grab your pitchforks. Grab your pitchforks, all right, fellas. Send it to Walmart Canada Corp, 1940, Argentina Road, Mississauga, Ontario. <laughs> uh. L5N1P9. Because their mailing address is at the bottom of the website. Ah. Uh. <laughs> you can also yell at them on Facebook, Twitter, Pinterest, and Instagram. Yell at us at any of those as well. I don't have a Pinterest. I'm Nor do I, because I'm not a 16-year-old girl, but <laughs> as it were. You mean you can find 16-year-old girls on Pinterest? I mean, that's all you can find there. So... Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Probably a bad thing. Okay. If you've ever tried to use Pinterest and you're like, then huh... I then I changed my mind on being excited about that. Yeah. <laughs> You're like, oh, 16, so in two years I can use Pinterest? <laughs> uh, no. Oh, no. They have... Football-themed steak knives. Hell yeah. Including Houston, Texas, and Minnesota Vikings, Pittsburgh Steelers. But they're all painted... They're, they're colored? They are all painted and colored. Oh my god. Yeah. And they're $58 Canadian apiece. For a set of four. No. Look at this dumb idiot. I'm not talking about the guy sitting next to you. I'm talking about <laughs> the ATST. 
He was like, oh, we're just gonna do that. We. Well, I'll just toss stuff at you, you it's dingus. A, it's a chicken walker. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I have to do the exact same motion controls. Ooh, I don't like that at all. That is blurry. It is hard to look at. Boing. Ooh, the Oakland Raiders one looks really nice. That, uh, slate gray. Ooh. Not that you'd want to have those. No. But it's cool to see them. I, I, I'm not a, a ball fondler kind of person. Thank nah. It's no sports ball fondling. <laughs> My kind of football is also called soccer. Yeah. Agreed. Uh, oh, I don't like the Green Bay Packer one, so... That is not the wrong... That right color of green. Yuck. It's like a weird off color of teal. Is disgusting so, um, and deplorable. Are we going to play more of this stupid game? Because mm. I'm looking at steak knives now. Uh, If that's any judgment of this game, then <laughs> no. We most certainly will not. There are over 99 pages of... Steak knives? Set steak four items. 6,000 items. Well, I killed a gonk droid. I think my life is complete. Alright, I think we're done here. Bye-bye. Goodbye.